Hi all, Terhi Koskinen here. I'm super excited to be guest designer for Pink Press Studio this month and I have created a couple of layouts and one mini book for this guest design spot and this is one of the layouts. Uh, I'm using Joyful Day collection which is just like the <laughs> name is very joyful and bright and happy and um, I want to use all those frames from one of the patterned papers. Um, I have this pace in my life that I want to use all the colors in without mixing them so I had this idea of having green blue and pink thing <laughs> piece of paper in um, in a layout on a layout and then just add lots of beautiful things around and then add something mixed media like uh, as the last phase of creating crosses um, what I did now is that I adhere all those green, blue and pink uh, pattern papers and I used really thick 3D foam to adhere them because as you see I want to add a lot of stuff around them and a bit underneath them so there must be some space between the background paper and the pattern paper. I'm adding all the frames like pink next to pink, blue next to blue, and you get the idea. Also, I'm trying to play this similar uh, color game with uh, embellishments, but that's probably not going to happen, happen like 100%, but we'll see. I will try it, at least. and. I have all these ephemera to use and the chipboard stickers and lots of beautiful embellishments so I think I can handle this quite well. Um, sometimes people are asking why can you add so many um, phrases and words to your layouts but I don't mind. I, I really don't mind if I had a lot of text um, if I don't have this huge title, I can add lots of small words and lots of small things and then one of them can be the title and usually I um, add my journaling to the backside of the layout because I write a lot and also I don't like my handwriting at all but uh, let's just say that I really like to write big big uh, long journalings. But anyway, the last phase of creating this layout is to add some watercolor. I first thought about adding some mists or paint, but watercolor is my go-to <laughs> product because I really like the way that you can use it on almost everything. So again, the same idea green to green, blue to blue, and pink to pink. And I think I managed it quite well. And I'm only adding the uh, watercolor to the frame parts, and I think it makes, makes this layout much more fun than adding it all around the pattern papers. Hope you are inspired, and I hope you have <laughs> have had some kind of new tricks or ideas to your next layout and if so please share them with me I would love 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 to see them uh, thank you Think Fresh Studio for having me guesting and um, thanks for watching see you soon bye